everyone, Amy Love here, back to share with you some yummy goodies from Angel Dream Crafts Kim on Etsy. And I will put the link to her store below so that you can go over and get you some of the beautiful yumminess. So I'm going to start with these uh, beautiful pink butterfly appliques. Now I have um, shared these before, but they're so stinking cute and they're layered. So it's like you've got a butterfly and then a bow and then a pearl and I absolutely love them. And they're riveted so it's not like they're going to fall off. So super cute. I love these. Love them. Let's see where they're going. Now, um, I don't know uh, how many of you haven't been over there to see her vintage laces, but they are absolutely gorgeous and I'm going to share some of them with you here. I think I'm pretty sure this is one of them. And this is so delicate and so pretty and it's one of these that you can lace through some ribbon at the top so cute i love how soft it is absolutely gorgeous and then there's this one this one's kind of um, an off-white i would say very very pretty these kind of laces i love to put um, on top of fabric so that the pretty fabric is peeking through. I just love that's going to look so gorgeous. My husband is outside plowing and he could he could burst in at any moment, so just be aware. But she also got some vintage eyelet laces, which you know makes me very very happy because I love the eyelet. Isn't this just so sweet? Absolutely precious. So precious. And here is another one of the vintage eyelets. Which way does it go? I can't tell. I think it goes this way, though. Oh, yeah. You can tell by the top. Okay. Hello. Isn't it pretty? Look at how cute that is. That's adorable. Absolutely adorable. And then look at this one. This is so soft. I can't. I love soft lace. I love it because it lays so nicely when it's soft. So this is a very soft, beautiful, beautiful lace. And then there is this beautiful lace. Isn't that sweet? So gorgeous. And then, oh, look, I have had this probably in four different colors. I think I've had it in cream, in taupe, in lilac, and this one is white. I love this. When you dangle this off of a project, it just adds such beauty. And you can also gather it up. Sorry, my nose is tickling. My allergies are bad right now. Gather it up and dangle it off. It's just a beautiful, beautiful lace, and I was very excited when she got some more of this in, so I love it. Love that. And then I got another dangle, of course, because you can never have enough dangles. And look at how long this one is. Isn't that gorgeous? So you can cut these off and use them individually, and then you'd still have this beautiful trim at the top. So it's very versatile. Love that. Is it versatile or versatile? I don't know. <laughs> tomato, tomato. Eh, you know what I mean. Not pretty. So pretty. And then I got a couple of more of these because look how big these are. I mean, these are huge and they're like, they're gorgeous. I wonder if I can, did I, can I focus on the metals? Yes. And what I love to do with these is I alter these which I think I have a video for. So if I, if I remember, I will link it up here in the iCards on how I turn this into an embellishment. But I basically emboss over the top of it and then, um, you know, you can add bits of snippets of lace, uh, cabochons, bling, so many things. So loving these, I got two more, they're awesome. And then I got some more of her amazing bling love the sparkle her bling has and these um, you might recognize I used them on my bling Christmas tree and then I was like I need some more of those please because they are beautiful and I'm actually going to be using these 
it's here. Sometimes it'll focus and sometimes it won't. Anyway, I'm going to be using these as flower centers this time. So um, I enjoy making flowers. It's one of the things I do to relax. And uh, in the winter when you're snowed in, I mean, nothing brings me more joy than being able to spend some time making flowers. So these will be going in the middle of those flowers because they're gorgeous. So um, I hope everybody's doing well. And thanks for watching, everybody. And I will see you on the next one.